Hello guys, I'm BatDan16 PS3 and welcome to my new Let's Play series on Gran Turismo 6. I'm sorry about the Formula 1 series being cut short. I sort of, The editing was just taking far too long and it was putting a lot of strain on me and I just couldn't get the videos out quick enough. So, sorry about that. But anyway, I'm back now with Gran Turismo 6 and this is just the tutorial, air quotes, tutorial. Uh, for the driving simulator. Uh, it just tells you to go around the Brand Hatch Indy Circuit. No, it's not actually the Indy Circuit, it's the Grand Prix Circuit, sorry. And uh, it just tells you how to go into corners, slow in, fast out, break on the red line. And it's all generally boring. But just going around the second corner now. Oh, crap, it's automatic gears. I did not want automatic gears. I hate automatic gears. I want to choose when to change gear. I bought the game. It's going to be a royal pain in my ass. So, the main reason I bought this game is that I've always been a fan of the Gran Turismo series. I've been playing it since Gran Turismo 1 on the PS1. I used to play it around my nan's house. And I've played every version since. I've uh, nearly completed all of the A-Spec races on Gran Turismo 5. I've just got the two endurance races left to go. The 24 hours of Le Mans and the 24 hours of the Nürburgring. Which I'm not looking forward to because that's two whole days of my life that I won't get back. I'll just be playing a game. I know you can suspend it but it sort of takes out the illusion of how tired you'd be after the end of it. And my apologies about that line, that was terrible. Um, but yeah, it takes out the uh, reality of being up for 24 straight hours racing a car around a circuit. But I might get back to that at some point. Oh, found the horn button. Sorry, just fiddling with the settings on my steering wheel, see what I could play with. So, coming to the end of the tutorial. Nice straight shot to the line. It's really put the hammer down. Ooh, 104 miles an hour. Epic speed. Can't even remember what car this is. Nice work. Would I like to try again? Uh, no. Congratulations on finishing your first track day. As a reward, you've been given some credits. Yay, 30,000 monies. Start up out by purchasing a Honda Fit RS10. It's not exactly the most exotic of cars, but... I guess in the beginning of these games you always have to start slow. I don't want sunset orange, I want black. Beautiful. Do I want to buy it? Of course I do. Look at it, all pretty and black. And I acquired the paint colour too. Right. Congratulations on acquiring your first car. Each car has a performance rating. Uh, it's 346 for example. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Select dealerships on the home screen. Obviously you just made me do that. So why would you tell me to do that? It makes no sense. So let's come out of this. Time to get started in your first race. Go to the novice class license in career mode. It's hardly career mode, it's just race the let round a lot of tracks. Right, Sunday Cup. Uh, high speed ring, two laps. I remember this track. 430 pp or less. Ooh, just over 4,000 credits for a gold. Still 2,000 for a bronze, it's not bad. And typical opponents, a mini, Corsa, and a club. Alright, Sunday Cup race one. High speed ring. I've got two Canadians, an American, Dutch, and a Polish. And none of those cars that are in the opponent list as cars that you would expect to come up against are actually racing against me. So, well done. 23 degrees, 10 past 4 in the afternoon. It's kind of late to be racing, but 
I guess this track doesn't really exist, so it could be anywhere in the world. It doesn't matter what seasons are going on. Alright, let's get into this. Start. Let's change my view. That's too wide. I really want that. Mm. Let's see how it goes. No. Nope. Wasn't a fan of it, I'll stick to the bonnet cam. Catching up on these guys pretty fast. Am I gonna get through the middle? In the inside? Yeah, got them both. Awesome. That's the Polish and the Dutchman quickly dispatched. Time for them yank next. Whoa, back end stepped out. Uh, too quick, too quick, too quick, too quick, too quick. Not the best line through that corner. And would you believe it, I've forgotten to turn automatic gears off. I'm still on auto gears, I still can't choose when I want to change gear. At least it's only two laps and it's a fairly quick circuit, I guess. Right. American, what are you driving? Honda CRZ. Yeah, it's not a right car. Ooh, too close, too close. Let's see if we can dive up the inside of this one. Nope. Thanks for slamming the brakes on, dickhead. And just for that, I'm going to go around your outside. Right, up to second at the end of the first lap. Not bad. Oh, CRZ's having a go at the bloke behind. Will he get him? Nope. Sorry, fill around with the buttons again. Turn the wipers on and bled the horn. Actually, the horn might come in useful. Let's get close enough to first place this Canadian and let's see if I can scare him with my horn, shall we? Right, closer, 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 closer. Let's see if I can do it down into the braking zone and scare him out of the way. Nope, didn't work. Never mind. He's in a Prius. What the hell is a Prius doing in first place? They are useless cars. Sorry, my views are uh, based on Top Gear in the UK, so I'm biased against Priuses. Gently does it around this one. Let's whack the hammer down. So I can pull away from him. Don't seem to be pulling away too far. Only less, just less than half a second. It's not quite good enough. Oh, just looked at the mini-map. He's trying to come at me. Full throttle around this last bend. Yeah, there we go. He gets stuck halfway around because he has to dab the brakes like the other guy did. And just a straight shot to the line. Let's see if I can beat my lap time. Yeah, by a second and a half. Yeah, and I got a trophy. First of many. I'm guessing that's for winning your first race. And the Prius comes past me at the end. Too late, pal. Nice 4,000 credits. Up to 17,020. And I get three stars for completing the race, finishing th uh, third and finishing first. Managed to win on your first time out too. Look forward to seeing how you cope as a driver. Well, I'm sure I'll do pretty well once I actually earn some money I can buy some decent cars. Let's exit out of this. to another loading screen. And let's go three laps. Oh, another thing. Start menu at the top right. Yeah, I see it. can change options. You can even reassign your horn and windscreen wipers. I just found what buttons they are. No thanks. Alright, so three laps around the Autumn Ring Mini. Uh, get an extra 100 credits for finishing first in this one. And the same three typical opponents as last time. Let's see if I actually get one, shall we? Race two. Right, let's see the starting grid, shall we? Uh, nope, not a single one of those typical opponents is in. 
first things first. Let's change my gearing. Let's just double check the other settings. Yeah, they're fine. Right, I can now change gear when I want to. Let's do this. Quarter to three in the afternoon. Oh, sunny and raining. Wonder what might happen. There's no surface water at the moment, but that doesn't mean there won't be any. Oh, look at that car. It's like a box on wheels. It doesn't look very pretty at all. Right, let's go after the Dutch guy who was, I think was in the last race, wasn't he? I don't know, don't pay that much attention. Can we slide it up? No, too far back. Oh, it's so nice to be able to change gear when I want. Get the complete max out of the car. Can we take him here? No, still too far back. Here. Perfect. Just ran wide. No. Thanks for cutting across me. Though, to be fair, I was trying to bash my way through. I'll just do it there instead. Snooze you lose. Wada. Alright. Accelerate. Let's try and catch this polo in front. Can I get him here? He, he, oh, no. Shit, 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 shit. Get back, get back, get back. Oh, almost ran wide. Can I get him? No. That was an awful line through there. I took too, way too much grass. I can get him here now, though. Beat him out to this corner. Oi! Do you not see me? Hey! Hitting me up the rear after I've already overtaken you, you little bell end. Right. Ooh, Mazda. Beautiful car. It's a shame that convertibles are seen as more as women's cars. Slipstreaming. At 70 miles an hour. Outbreak? No. Ooh, nearly lost my front. I can get him here now, though. Better exit out of the corner. Although he's trying to squeeze me to the outside. Make sure I leave enough room. I'm going to try and keep my racing as clean as possible. But obviously some idiots. I.e. AI. Don't seem to recognise when there's a car next to you. A little bit wide. <laughs> I set it to manual transmission so that I could choose when to change gear and I still end up over revving the thing. Uh, first, well, second race in a new, new game so I'll uh, give myself some slack for that one. And three laps, each better than the last one, so that's good enough. Winning by just less than a second. Mm, yeah, five seconds over last place, not bad. Ah, 4,100 credits. Love it. Start to build up that bank balance. Uh, no, I don't want to retry. Let's go to exit. Also, the Amateur Cup's now available. That will be the next video. I'm going to try to get these out once a week. Um, as best I can. But, thanks for watching.